Now, ladies and gentlemen, tonight we are going to present an elaborate production. Music arranged by Meredith Wilson, dances staged by George Murphy, in honor of the gay 90s. Fifteen beautiful girls in the costume of the period, and two beautiful prima donnas as soloists. Every one of the girls in the chorus was selected not only for her beauty, but for her outstanding voice. And I guarantee, among Bob, other things, uh, that you... Bob. What is it, George? Uh, you know, I rehearsed those chorus girls for 18 hours yesterday. I know, George. I'm giving you credit. Well, fine. And I don't I, see... uh, then I rehearsed them again today for six hours, you know. I know, George. You did a fine well, job. Uh, That's thanks great. very much, Bob. Now, there's I... just one, there's one thing, Bob. What's that? The girls got so tired rehearsing, they can't come for the show. I'll see you later, Bob. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, the two beautiful prima donnas who will sing our gay 90s extravaganza were especially imported from New York and have been trained for two years by New York's leading opera coach. I take great pleasure in presenting to you, oh, uh, Mademoiselle... Bob. Uh, Bob. Uh, prima donnas? Mm-hmm. In the hospital. Uh, prima donnas? Mm-hmm. In the hospital. What happened? Uh, did you see that long flight of stairs leading down to the stage? Yes. Well, they didn't. I'll see you later, Bob. <laughs> well, this is getting to be quite a production. <laughs> well, Meredith Wilson has been at great pains with the musical arrangements for this beautiful pageant. And he will conduct it now with a skill and finesse for which he is famous. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, I now present oh, Bob, to you... Bob, the... Just a minute, Bob. Wilson? Mm-hmm. Oh, <laughs> well, what happened to him? He's one of the prima donnas. That's all I need. Who's going to be the other one? I hate to tell you, Frank Morgan. And I'm going to lead the orchestra. I wash my hands of the whole production. Get okay, on. here we go. Frank Morgan and Meredith Wilson, these two beautiful creatures, present me and Marie. <laughs> On Saturday night when my work is through You always call on Marie ooh, ooh. Then we hop on a bicycle built for two And go scorching down to the sea After one or two whirls to the German band We go strolling under the moon Till we find a nice spot on the silvery strand, then gee with how we spoon. You ought to see little me and Marie by the old seaside. By the ocean we pet and we'd set and we'd pet till we get swept out by the tide. You may have been to Paris. And had both of your eyes open wide But you ought to see me and Marie by the old seaside If you want to see a thing of beauty You should see me spooning with my little cutie By the old seaside For when once we get the proper setting We begin a petting and we go a petting Till we end by getting such an awful wetting from the tide First, we talk about this and that a bit. Then we walk about and hug and kiss a bit. Till we finally find a place where we can hide. Then, until the crowing of the chickens, Frankie and Marie proceed to raise the chickens by the old sea Frank Morgan and Meredith Wilson in the barbershop harmony of the 90s. Now time creeps on. What? Look, Ted, on the tray, hot Maxwell House coffee. On the wall, the clock. 20 seconds, 28 seconds to go. Time creeps on. Oh, I get it, I get it. Folks, join us in that friendly custom of ours, our moment of relaxation over a steaming, fragrant cup of the new Maxwell House coffee. Come on, hitch up your chair. Here's your cup and yours. You take cream and sugar? Now, wouldn't it be swell if you could all be here with us? But even if you can't be here in person, you can in spirit. All you need is a steaming cup of the richer-bodied, more fragrant new Maxwell House and the music of Meredith Wilson. We now pause briefly for station identification. KFI Los Angeles. 